Hey guys, this is Smriti. Welcome to my channel. Today's video is a very special one. I love, love, love challenge videos. And today we're going to do palette bingo. I'm going to use like five big palettes that I have in my collection, all different brands. So I have Melt's Amore Mariposa palette. I have actually rearranged this palette. So I'm just going to keep it like this just because I don't want to like mess up around <laughs> with it. But this is how my palette looks. I mean, it's just Mariposa's shades, just rearranged. And then I have a BH Norvina 5 palette if you know I'm a big purple lover <laughs> and this is like full of purple and nude tones I really really wanted to use this too and then the third palette that I have is the Blend Bunny Cosmetics Primal palette so this is like all rainbow shades so I feel like we are on to color today so I'm super excited to see this in action too and then we have Glam Lights Michaela palette which is if you know like this is so colorful and so beautiful and the shimmers are absolutely spectacular i cannot wait to see like what kind of a mismatch do we have on our eyes like coming up <laughs> and the last certainly not the least i wanted to play with my ColourPop so jaded palette too which was in collaboration with kathleen lights and some of the shades might be a little mix matched but most of the shades are from so jaded palette so i definitely wanted to use that too so that is what we have in for us i wanted to utilize some of the palettes that i already have and what is more better to have like a palette bingo and like play and have like creativity i'm not going anywhere so even if i look like a clown i'll be okay with it <laughs> but i'm gonna try and do like a good beautiful makeup let's see how it rolls so if you're interested see let's begin okay i have my trusty alexa here so she's gonna pick up a random number and we're gonna put it on the eyes so let's begin we'll first start off in the order that we started actually right so Melts Amori Mariposa palette. How many shades do we have? We have 20 shades. Okay. So let's see. Alexa, pick a random number between 1 and 20. Pick a number between 1 and 20. It's 14. 14. Can you even see that? Alexa, turn up your volume by 5. Okay. She said 14. Okay. So 5, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. We have a beautiful purple. Now you know I love purples so i'm super super excited about this and this one actually this one was the shade nube i think so i'm just gonna take that so that's our first shade beautiful beautiful purple okay let's begin with the second palette and this is the michaela palette and this we have 30 shades yeah we have 30 shades so let's begin alexa pick a random number between 1 and 30 Here's a number between 1 and 30. It's 12. 12. So 6 and 12. This one, the shade is Cookie. I can work with it. Cookie is more like a bronzy tone uh, shade. So that's Cookie. That's Cookie. Good. Beautiful. Deep. We're definitely going with deep tones. <laughs> we know that. Okay, next let's take Primal Palette. Uh, we have how many shades? Six. Those are 24, 25, 26. So we have 26 shades. Alexa, pick a random number between 1 and 26. Here's a number between 1 and 26. It's 9. 9. So 6, 7, 8, 9. Yellow. The shade is Ray. If you know me, you know I don't like my yellows. <laughs> but we'll see, we'll see, we'll see. Don't get discouraged right now, Smithy. You can do it. So that is a ray. One from each palette should do. Like I'll have like five shades. And I feel like five is a good number to have like an eyeshadow look with. The next one is ABH Norvina 5 palette. And we have 25 shades here. Alexa generate a random number between 1 and 25. Here's a number between 1 and 25. It's 23. 23. So we have this shade, which is E3. That is, it's a beautiful purple shade. It's like a pinky purple shade. I really, really love that shade. That's good. I feel like we can definitely do something with this. Right? Yeah. Okay. 
we'll see what comes in <laughs> the last Colourpop So Jaded palette because that can completely throw us off. Again, we have 30 shades. Okay, so let's choose. Alexa, select a random number between 1 and 30. Hmm, I'm not sure. What? What are you not sure about? Alexa, select a random number between 1 and 30. Sorry, I'm not sure about that. I don't like her. Sometimes I just don't like her. Alexa, select a random number between 1 and 30. Hmm, I'm not sure. Oh my God. Alexa, pick a number between 1 and 30. Here's a number between 1 and 30. It's 19. 19. So 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19. Geo dude. Okay. Okay. We'll see. So that is Geo Jude. It's basically like a, a one shade darker than my skin tone. I feel like we can do something. The only thing that I'm missing is like a lighter tone for the inner corners. Mm, I actually do have like an inner corner like highlight shade, but disregard that. I went outside somewhere, so that's why I did it. But um, let's do something with this. Let's do something with this. Okay. I feel like we we can do things with it. So let's begin. So I'm going to first start off with this shade, the Geodude shade from the So Jaded palette. Because that's like a safe bet, I feel like. <laughs> so I'm going to take that. And I'm going to place that as like my transition shade. It's more like a bronzer, but like a mustardy tone for me. Ignore the liner that I have. Again, I went outside somewhere. So I had to do my base. And uh, that's why you see a liner and a little bit of mascara. So that is Geodude. I don't even know if you guys can see that or not. But that's definitely like a very much like a transition shade for me. Nothing like groundbreaking right now. <laughs> okay. So let's start with our primal palette shade, which is a Ray. So I'm going to take Ray in my inner third of the eyelid. Right here. And we can definitely build it up. I'm not big on yellows. Like, I'm not big on like super, super bright shades. <laughs> but it's always fun to have like, you know, unique shades. That's the beauty about like palette bingers. It's like Makeup Gods always know that I'm not a big fan of yellows and greens. I'm super happy that green didn't come. <laughs> because last time I did a palette binger, it was full of greens. Oh my God. I look like a walking Christmas tree. Like not even kidding. So we have that shade all across the inner third of the eyelid. So now let's move on to the purple shade. And that purple came from Mariposa palette from Met Cosmetics. I want a tighter brush. So let's do that. So I'm going to take the Sigma brush, Sigma small blend practice brush. I'm going to take this shade, which is actually Nube. I'm going to tap off the excess. And then place that. Look how pigmented that shade is. I love it. I love purples. I'm going to first tap it and then start blending it. Especially because this purple is like super cool tone and yellow is like super warm toned. So we definitely want to be like a little bit of mindful of that. And slowly blend into that yellow. I'm also going to take the same shade on my lower lash line. Such a gorgeous shade of purple. I really love melt formulas. 
especially the jewel tones oh my god they just do grungy jewel tones so beautifully i'm just gonna melt it together just like that and then i'm gonna go back to that geodude shade from the so jaded palette from colourpop so that i can like melt the transition of that purple and that yellow together so that it doesn't look muddy because it has that mustardy shade i feel like that can flow really good actually i feel like makeup gods were on our side today so it completely creates like a different shade when i'm like blending the geodude shade with that purple i like it i really like it okay i'm gonna just put a little bit of a glitter glue and i'm just gonna place that on my eyelid and i feel like we're gonna do a reverse technique because we do have that you know the bronzy shade and that purple shade but if we do the same technique it'll be like the bronze would be in the beginning and then purple would be in the end i want to just flip it around i want to do purple in the beginning and then bronze and then going into that purple we'll see how it rolls it it makes sense in my head i don't know how much it makes sense generally mm. so we, we'll test it out <laughs> there's only one way to know <laughs> okay i'm gonna take this cookie shade from the glam light Michaela palette and I'm gonna place that right there melting into that purple shade in a diagonal way it's a very beautiful bronzy shade really pretty like look at that so beautiful I love love that palette you totally can create this look only using this palette too because you do have your purples you have that bronze you have the yellows you totally have everything in this palette to, to create this eye look just like that i'm gonna get back into that purple shade so just taking that same shade and just melting it with that bronze just like that because i definitely don't want to lose that purple taking a clean blending brush just blending the edges it's turning out to be a grungy look for sure <laughs> okay now let's move into the norvina 5 palette and take that shade which is e3 so i'm gonna take that and then start applying that from the inner corners just like that i definitely want a little bit more sparkle so i'm going to apply it with my fingers because i know it's super super sparkly shade i'm just melting into that bronze just like that that just took over the entire look really beautiful shade i'm gonna take a precise brush just so that i get to the inner corners i definitely don't want to lose that bronzy shade so i'm going to dip into the bronze too like that cookie shade and just intensify and mix that with that purple shade I feel like we lost the yellow in the mix when we were doing everything. So I'm going to go back to that primal palette with the shade Ray. And I'm going to take it on like a pencil brush. And that will be our inner corner shade. Just like that. I feel like that just pops up the yellow so much. Yep. Really, really like that. Okay. I'm going to finish this eye off with some liner and mascara and I'll get right back. And that is my final look. 
I finished off with my lips and this is a Natasha Denona's Yana lipstick. I generally do pair up all my purple eyeshadows with this lipstick because I feel like that's like my go-to nude. So I really, really wanted to talk to you guys about that too. But I feel like it's a very wearable look for me because purples are like my wearable shades. I feel like makeup gods were also with us to create this beautiful look so i really hope that you guys enjoyed this makeup look if you do like palette bingo videos we can do a multiple palette bingo videos with like different like only using anastasia palettes or only using like indie palettes do let me know in the comment section below and we can have fun with it if you do like these kind of videos do give it a thumbs up and also subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and ring that notification bell so that you're notified every time that i post next i generally upload three videos every single week every tuesday thursdays and saturday at 9 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. Until next time, I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.